my beauties and welcome back to the Pear Bear Squad and of course Gaming with Shelly. Let's get on to the rules for our beautiful Whimsy Story Legacy Challenge. We are in Generation 1 and the outcome of this is without a home but not without love. Our story begins as most stories do with endurance. You start off homeless, you've gone into the world with nothing but a tent and a dream and as a child you never had your own home. You were bounced from place to place, always dreaming of a suburban home to call your own, with a family of your own. As you have since you were a young child, you long for a life of normality. You are tired of everything around you being turbulent and broken. So you search for joy in the mundane. Life is lonely at first, but fortunately you find love with another homeless sin. Sin? Sim? <laughs> you have nothing, but it feels like absolutely everything when your partner by your side. You are a carefree, nature-loving and naive dreamer. Some may call you a hippie, but you just call yourself happy. From the ground up, you have to create everything. You create candles, fabricate your own furniture and search dumpsters to make it by. Eventually, you have a home of your own built by your own two hands. A tiny home. Not only is this a tiny home, but it is a suburban tiny home. Your dream is realized. Your goals for Gen 1 are to find love while homeless, Name all your children after nature. Must live in a suburban style tiny home that you build cheap free for your entire life. You start with a micro home for your young adult years and after that you can upgrade. You foster a very healthy garden. You are a plant parent and I mean your house is full of plants which fit into 32 tiles. Have at least three tattoos. Master the fabrication, handiness and wellness skills. Have love outdoors and freaking traits. And of course I added in the maker trade. You also have to complete the maker aspiration. Be self-employed with the freelance simply crafted career. Rarely wear makeup. Love to dress casually. This is of course the rules for only Gen 1. And we will of course fill you in with the rules for every single generation as we go on in this Let's Play. So I hope you guys have enjoyed listening to the rules in a different way to today. And let's get on.
Hello, my wonderful pair birds, and welcome back. Welcome back to another episode of our wonderful Whimsy Challenge. Um, I just have to remind myself not to get too close to the microphone so I am not overpowering you with my voice because it is very hard to edit out the roughness of it. So guys, this is what we actually did. I hope you liked the little spitty build at the start of this. So, here we are. Um, I moved the rooms around. I know the front door now comes into the bedroom. Um, I was going to kind of have it here to the side of the house. And then we could have like a whimsical garden to the side. Um, however, that did not actually... Why didn't I do that? I'm not sure. But anyways, let's just have a look at the lovely greenhouse that we did. And as you saw from my speed build, I did double check to make sure it wasn't taking any extra tiles. And it didn't. Oh my god, the grow tree actually came back. Nice one. So our girl is meant to be the one that is um, obsessed with gardening as well. This is why the two of them get on so well. Um, and they are doing awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Um... I have her working on her skills as well. We did bring the uh, griller out and I did get rid of the oven because uh, one, oh frick, we can do fried fish. Okay. Um, and I still forgot to get a bin. All right, so we're going to quickly get a recycle bin. There is recycler bins that you can get. I'm also going to see if I can actually... I've had her building. Oh my god, we had three chairs. I thought I only had her two too. So let's just move this uh, here. I'm going to move this plant out for a second. Um, so because you have a bit of a covering, can we pop you here? All right, I'm going to pop this uh, around to the side of the house just for now. Because we do kind of have a bit of a shelter here. And so let's pop a chair here. Why can't we pop a chair there? Okay, I'm going to leave one in inventory. Move you over. Can I pop her there now? I can. Awesome. Okay, so we do have some bonsai plants that we've had our lovely, um, our lovely husband uh, sorting out. Um, he's doing the bonsai tree, so I think that's going to be his passion. And then, of course, um, the painting as well. And the cow plant. They're going to be his main focus. And then when she's a little bit uh, further along in her pregnancy. We are definitely going to be. Um, what's the word guys. All right, I'm going to place these all in the inventory. Except for one lamp. Which I'm going to put in the middle of here. Alright that's that done. Now we need a recycle bin. Oh we got another garden pot. Ooh, look our background. Our backyard area is definitely going to be something that everybody is going to be jealous of we've got a beautiful little greenhouse and then we've got this area here and as we the kids get older we will of course um where would the recycle all right here's our recycle bin trash talking recycle bin by lipco industries this trash talker recycle bin is so good i'm actually going to turn down some of the audio it's so loud all right i've turned down the music um, because some of this music is mad and I'm going to turn on some of the voices. So we still have some of the sound effects from our buttes, our buttes. And here is me not double checking that the microphone was on. Okay, so we have got the recycle machine here. Uh, it even recycles itself every 30 days. Wow, okay. Let's get one that kind of like, you know, it resembles who we are. So there we go. We've got that one. And then I'm thinking inside the house, she should have a bin in the kitchen. Can we, all right. Oh, we can actually get rid of this ourselves. Okay, that's awesome. Um, We've got lots of stuff in here that we could. We have bonsai buds. Doesn't he, he wanted to grow more bonsais. And bonsais are still... Um, in season so let I'm gonna pop a few more bonsai buds um, out here for him there we go what are you you are a partially plant 
that would not grow in the house and it would not grow on one of these yolks. So yeah, we'll leave you there. Um, I do have another plant in here somewhere. Here she is. It's a grow tree. So I'm going to leave her there. Okay, so we've got more so bonsai buds for him. We've got a lot of strawberry bushes and spliced, spliced plants. Um, I can't fit any more in here, otherwise she will not be able to get in and garden or do anything. So I will pop what I can out here. Uh, baby is due in autumn weather. Baby is due in the autumn weather. Um, do you know what? We'll pop our dining chair here and then we'll get her make another one and that's four. Okay. Um, that's that. Okay, let's have a look. Okay, so for some reason, these wouldn't work outside when we were trying to plant parsley's. But they do work when we're trying to plant spinach, which is a little weird. Um, okay, so she's going to do some fabricating and then... Um, can she cook garden salad? Do we have enough veg in our fridge to do a garden salad? If not, all right, we have enough to do fruit salad, no price. Um, what about a garden salad? Uh, garden salad. Did I go past the garden salad? Um, if it's not popping up like fully green, then it means I cannot make it. Look, we can't make it. We need tomato and lettuce. Okay, so let's kind of do a family size of um, fruit salad. Because uh, that's all we have. I do need him. I need somebody to... Um, find some tomato plants. Can we find tomato plants? Um, okay, let's enlarge this. Okay, so we do have green peppers. We have green beans. We have, of course, got spinach. We have parsley. Um, we have tara root. And I don't know if we can eat bonsai. Um, no, we can't. And we can't put flowers in it. That is another thing I actually want to do. Um, can you resume this painting? Um, I want to see if we can actually get a tomato plant. A potato plant. A potato plant. Uh, what else can we get? Uh, I'm not sure. Alright, so I'm going to let her finish fabricating. I think she's too tired to cook. So I'm going to have... No, she's actually hungry. Have we any leftovers in our fridge? We do. Okay. Um, you know. Frick it. How is his needs? He is doing okay. He's just sleepy. Alright, okay. So he has to fertilize five plants. Okay, we can do that. Uh, fertilize with a bluebell. So we can actually fertilize with the bluebells we have in our inventory. Uh, we have a lot of bluebells. Okay, can we fertilize? All right, we can. We can. Okay, this is pretty cool. Um, let's go and fertilize his bonsai. And we'll even get him to plant some more. Okay, there we go. We got him doing lots of stuff right now. Um, he is getting tired. So once he has all that done, we will, of course, uh, send him to bed. She's going to eat outside. I think we're covered. Let's have a look. Uh, yeah, because I put the I pulled the roof out too far, so she is covered by the roof, which is awesome. And I think, like um, as we go on, we can kind of um, dangle some plants down here, and that'd be pretty cool, I think. And uh, she needs to fabricate five items. Okay, how's our skills going? <laughs> We even have a flower arranging. Right. Wellness is five. Handiness is eight. Fabrication is five. Okay, so handiness we're going to max completely before we know it. Um, can we purchase some veg? I'm wondering if we'd get... Now, is to me a show, is it a plant or is it a fruit? That's what I want to know. Is it a plant or is it a fruit? We are wasting money on seeds. I know, guys. I know. 
you can hate on me in the comments if you want. I absolutely have no problem with that. Um, okay, so. What's wrong, girl? Uh, it does, her house is dusty and we don't actually have a way. Oh, wow. Okay, we got apple, carrot, grapes, green, be uh, green pea, and we have bell pepper. We've got lots of bell peppers. <laughs> All right, pop you in there. Okay, we can actually grow apple trees for the fall. Okay. So let's get on that. Let's pop out some apple trees. That way we will have apples all fall long and we can make apple pie. Um, how tired are you, my dear? You can actually do some plant, uh, planting because your needs are pretty well. Um, he is gone very flirty. He's also very, very wet. <laughs> She's loving the rain. She's like, I love the rain. I love the rain. Don't you ever worry. Why is there a vampire at our door? There's a vampire at our door. Let's just click on this. <laughs> no trespassing. Disallow vampires. Bye. Not out of my door. I don't want no vampires attacking us. Oh, frick, I thought that was something else for a minute. I thought that was someone else for me. I was about to freak out. Uh, Flood, can you leave? Bye. Toodaloo. Bye. Flood, please leave. Go away. Bye, Flood. Oh my god, could you imagine? Oh, she's feeling sick. Oh my god, she's feeling sick. Okay, this, uh, I'm going to have you use the bathroom and I think it's time you fell asleep because you need your sleep, Mama. You need your sleep. Alright, so we've got lots of stuff on Plopsy at the moment. Uh, we have that. I forgot we, I actually got the knitting uh, thing. Um, she can actually knit on the bed. I do really want her to um, knit beanies and stuff for her future children. Um, and the toys. I need to get her level up to a certain amount so that we can... Um, knit clothes and toys for our kiddos but I am going to let her go to sleep because she's tired okay since they actually got pregnant their sleep pattern is all over the place and there's one thing I haven't gotten him to do for such a long time and that's to go fishing Um, we did do the, the fertilizing of five plants okay so let's see Achieve level 10 in the garden skill, grow a cow plant, and evolve 10 excellent plants. Okay, so he literally has to get to level 10 in his gardening skill. That's awesome. And, you know, like, he will advance in his career pretty much by himself. I'm not going to make him do everything for his job. But, like, that extra hundred and something simoleons a day is awesome. Now, there's one part of the rules I actually wanted to go back over. Um, cottage living and, okay strawberries okay nice one um that apparently in the freelance part of the career is for simply crafted so i'm actually just going to kind of um see if there is in the freelance if there is then we have a lot more we can do um oh crikey Ooh, we acquired the knitting skill let's clean that spoiled food because we're not very good at that Okay, so it's apparently it's in the freelance section of it. All right, okay. Um, oh, crafter. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Okay. Simply crafted. Oh my god, I didn't know that. I thought it was like register as self-employed, but it's not. What's this? A new life within. Sometimes Celia is overwhelmed with delight at the feeling of her baby growing within. She can't wait for it to be born. Oh, that's so freaking adorable. Oh yeah, I got her, um, see here? I have her chair, so now she can act. I'm sorry, I just froze. I just froze. I was like, well, hold on a minute. Um, she can knit socks now. 
Ooh, let's knit some multicolored socks. We have not gone uh, dumpster diving in a very long time. Yeah, okay. She used to be afraid of the cow plant, but now she's not anymore. She is craving healthy food. Now, I absolutely love the new um, Pregnancy Wellness Month this because it actually, in the Relationship and Family Oaks, there is a section for us to actually go and get the food that we're craving. Go get craved food. And like it drops everything to go and get the food that she is craving for her pregnancy, which is freaking adorable, guys. It's adorable. When she comes back, oh, okay. Um, Lex, cow plant needs you. <laughs> go feed your cow plant. I don't want it uh, swallowing your wife again. <laughs> okay, so she's gone to get some, uh, you know, food craving things. Child on the way. A new life within. Engaged married craving healthy food uh neat knits and everything feels dirty okay i did get them a cheap cheap vacuum cleaner okay girl okay can this go in the recycling machine oh my god i can i like that i really like that okay um have we got anything my love that we can harvest <gasps> oh my god we can super sell have my um snapdragons come back up yet? They should be back up soon. Okay, we got a little money. Talk like a pirate day. It's talk like a pirate day. So she's come back knitting. She can vacuum when she comes out now that she's home. We can also work on handiness, of course, with um, another dining chair to make it a total of four dining chairs. Um, we never actually planted what we got. Um, and what day are we on? Day seven of summer. So literally tomorrow, our apples will start growing and our carrots will start growing and our grapes. There we go. Um, pop you back in there. Okay, so we technically have um, every plant for every season right now, except for winter. I don't know if there is winter plants, but um, you know, these are her these are her um, plant babies. So just like her real kid, are you? What are you? Out of season. You're a winter plant. What are you? Ooh, spinach is a winter plant. I did not know that. How did you get on? So I want his passion to be the bonsai trees. And like he absolutely loves his bonsai trees. So. Uh, oh, we can evolve this. Thank you. And does that mean, oh my God, we can convert it into a decorative. Yeah, he can go off into work. Um, so it just means that she's alone for the day. And after she finishes this dining chair for her final little dining set, um, we can plant and we can look after the baby. Um, I do really want him to give her a kiss. You know, like, I'm off to work. I won't be late. It's only for a few hours today and every little bit will help in our little baby, making sure that we can... Do stuff. Now, like, you see, you're going to see this little area here, like, the little crib will go here perfectly. Um, and then, like, we can move this table out and we can actually put an infant crib here. And then, I'm not sure how we're going to do it, but we can fit a bed somewhere. Um, although, like, I'll probably put the tent back out and mum and dad can sleep in the tent and we can turn this into the kids' room until we can upgrade. Um... Oh, that'd be kind of cool if I could make a tree house for the kids. Um, you have to go to work. So you're not going to have time. And mum is planting. So what did you catch actually before you go to work? I'm going to give a hot pause. All right, let's throw the fish in here. Awesome. Mum has everything but what we're going to throw the grapes in the green beans in and we've got some fresh herbs i really want to get a potato and tomato plant 
so we can make garden salads and do you know a bee a bee um hive because the fresh honey we can actually use smell the flowers I don't like I'm not going to get him to work harder and just let him enjoy his job it's what you want to okay so she is what were you going to do weeding oh she was going to weed her plant babies awesome okay so then we're going to get her to do we get her to do the final chair I cannot remember my head is scatty as anything and she's the one that's pregnant <laughs> um what happened? Oh my god, like, um, my game is literally just, she's, she's acting the maggot, because I've gone into, um, symbology, and look, apparently she's maxed out her young adult, and I don't know how she done it, um, because, like, there's no notification of her birthday. Look. Oh, there is. It's there. Apparently today is her birthday. But. I. There's no way. Like, she hasn't been a young adult for long. And when I try to try and fix it, it won't let me. So I have no idea what's happening. Um. Have we got enough points? Alright, reward store. To take... Isn't there like a youth potion or something? Sacred candles. I know like there's like we can potion of youth is one thousand five hundred simoleons. One thousand. Okay. What's his? Oh my god, he is enough. All our stuff is selling. He has enough points. So I'm gonna get him to get us the potion when he comes home because I don't know how to fix this. The game has glitched and now it's making her older than she actually is. There's no way she is. Um, So I'm going to get him to get the potion of you when he comes home because look, she is only in her first trimester. How is she only in her first trimester? I don't understand that. But she's talking to the plant. Okay, so... She was getting all these moodlets about dust and everything, and whatever I did, now there's no dust. Use the head. It's freaking annoying. So many glitches lately with this game, it's driving me insane. Okay, let's try and fabricate three more things. Okay, just to complete another part of this aspiration. Um, and, oh wait, actually, we can check for gigs coming. Let's check for gigs. Uh, full of regrets. Ro regrets. What's this? Turns out dry clean only. Not only simple. My new rugs toast. You know how to make rugs. I've got some onions. Maybe we can help each other. So she only needs fabrication level one for that one. Okay. So what do we do? Chat with the client. Um, we don't have a computer. I don't know if we have enough money to buy the cheapest computer. Okay. Um. <laughs> sell off all of them. Definitely sell that. We don't need it. Uh, okay. All right. Okay. We've sold over six hundred euros worth of stuff. Oh, someone contacted us about candle. Okay, turn it off. Oh, ship. Oh, we sold stuff. Ship. Okay, girl, go ship your things. And I will get us the cheap computer. A cheap computer. Um, I'm hoping I'll put it on this end of the table here because it's protected from the outside world elements so like that's a thousand euro that's a hundred get the laptop because then we can bring it with us we just sucked all our money into that for our freelance career how are you feeling about buying that bet you ain't feeling great 
By the way, we did get bills and it was like 196 simoleons for bills, so that was freaking cool. We successfully sold on Plopsy. So we actually successfully sold two things on Plopsy. All right, we should go to the freelance. Stop. We have to go to the freelance section and chat with client. And then we have to create a rug. Fabricate. A rug. Okay. Yeah, so create a rug. Okay. So chat with client, create a rug, and then you send your finished work to the client. Because we are on fabrication skill number five, we're over the level that they needed. And plus, plus guys, it works out for us. Okay. So because we have this sheltered area now, our uh, snapdragons and all that will... Oh, we've got some plants to evolve. You hungry? All right, I thought you were hungry. Okay, how's my plant babies doing? They're all good. I'd say tomorrow our snapdragons should start flopping back up again. So that's pretty cool. Alright, okay, so let's chat with the client and we've got to create rug. What time is Mr. Lex home at? He's not happy about some. Everything feels a bit dirty from being a dirty art. You live out in the middle of nowhere. You have a garden paradise and we have some beautiful weather today. Look at that sun. Let me look. Oh wow. Oh wow, that's bright. Uh, is that from the sun? Can we go right up? Where is the sun? Okay, but well, look at that. That's over the whole lot. <gasps> wow, okay, it would be beautiful to live with nothing but water around. <laughs> oh god, I love that. But you live out here and you spend most of your time in your garden and stuff. So please don't complain. It's just going to go do the fabricator. Why couldn't you go this way? Okay. How's our plants doing? You are out of season. Okay. All right. Okay. Fabrication, let us go. Oh, she's not happy. Rude client from chat. Some people just don't know. How to communicate. Uh, spirits are not high for this one. <gasps> what a day of work. Lex is back with 147 simoleons. That's my my husband. He does not like working though. It's okay bud. Let's come and let's pet with a uh, little Lex's baby. This is his little baby. That's my man. Okay. Alright, girl, what trimester are we in? We're still in the second trimester, the first trimester. Ah. Uh, who loves him? I love you. You got Let's get some pets and pets and pets, okay? <gasps> Ooh, let's have a look at this. Garden competition, the rare the better. Submit your healthiest, happiest plant to this competition. Uh, visit local shop stalls to purchase unique items. Share your tastiest, prettiest homemade pie to the judges and compete in the first competition to wear ribbons. Oh, we're not ready for this year. Oh, sugar. We don't have any plants. Definitely... Give that to Lex. He's going to be like, um, thank you. Once you face that and you submit to the client, I think, oh, he got level. Can we need anything else now? Okay, we're level. We fabricated three things. Did we not finish the crew socks? Um, okay. So what's the last part of our freelance gig? Locate the requested item in Daisy's inventory or household inventory, then send to client for approval by clicking on the item. Um, so it's in our household inventory. So 
How did I just submit it to a client? Okay. Um, here. Wait, how, how am I meant to submit this to client? Okay. Um, I am not sure how we do this one. Okay. Uh, then send a client for approval by clicking on the item in your or by using a computer. Use the freelancer category. Okay. Here we go. Um, freelance sent to a client for approval. There we go. All right. That makes so much more sense. <laughs> You have till like 9 a.m. Wednesday to do it, but like when we get a task, I kind of like to get them to do it uh, on the day to get it, just so you know we can do as many of these freelance gigs. Uh, no thanks. Uh, so we can do as many of these freelance gigs before baby comes. We are doing. Oh, hello. Have you heard painting paintings at the romance festival is? Knox, go away. Okay, he does not like work. Okay. I know, unfortunately, that's the worst thing. How about you come here and... What's wrong? What? Why do you do this? Why do you do this? Um, I hasn't got the whole I'm afraid of cow plant yet. So I'm thinking, you know, he's like, I'm going to give you a rest for the day. And, you know, we're just going to. Got essence of inspiration. Who are you? We have a visitor. Hello. Who are you? Yes. Okay, so she likes knitting. Um, so that's her preference now. The rug is even better than my last rug. Thank you so much. Um, she's finished the socks. Dashing, this is exactly what we were looking for. Keep up the great work, Daisy. So we got 200 simoleons for that job. Okay. Um, he is completely drowned. Okay. So she's just met a kid. I can't get four two wings. We have a kid on the bed. Um, are we officially now in? We're in the second trimester because her bump did get bigger. Okay. Uh, nice to meet you, Misty. Nice to meet you, but I think it's time you go home. Um, I'm a little hungry. So I'm going to get myself some... Oh, wow. Okay, we don't have anything in the fridge to eat. Hmm. Okay, she's done another one. Uh... Oh my girl it really needs the bathroom. Why are you slowing down again? Okay, please use the bathroom first and then you can eat your fruit salad. Good. Oh good girl, you put it back in. Good, that's my girl. Alright, okay, so here's the mark. Alright, what did we make? We got we made another candle, didn't we? Okay, what's our fabrication? All right, we need to achieve level seven fabrication, collect insects from the insect farm three times, and create that. We don't have an insect farm. Is that another purchase I'm going to have to make? Because she really hates spending money. Um, okay. Okay, let's get an insect farm. Because we have to master the fabrication skill, you know, 
Um, might do another job. Okay, would that be in outdoor skills? What's this? Okay, I'm moving too quickly with this because um, my game will crash. It will crash. Um, so yeah, I actually like the way I was able to do the the greenhouse after. But that was, of course, ooh, we made one floor lamp. We need two more for the job. Okay, so you're going to have to do two more of them. All right, okay, but first let's get the insect. Um, hotel, is it? This thing here. Insect farm. Okay. Ooh, we got a green and a yellow one. Okay, let's... Um, you know, I think it would be like so much better if we had it here. I'm going to have to turn on this again. Uh, move objects on. Here we go. Here we are. Okay, that's all we needed for that. And um, my girl did make some more flower pots. Did I actually? All right, it's over here. And we have bonsai plants. We have a grow fruit tree. We have a rose bush. Um, when Lex comes home, we will have him. All right, okay, so we need to make three more, not two more. Um, okay, sorry, I need to put my do not disturb thing on. Uh, we need to make two more um, floor lamp thingies for our actual freelance job. Wait, what? Wait, what? Okay, uh, local green thumbs are holding a harvest off a speed grow test to see how uh, what does X do? Focus effort to cultivate in a fruit finalist or spectate the cost is for free as a farming fan? Uh, spectate. We got full 20, right. I thought we had a gig where we had to do this fabrication. Right. So we have to fa uh, scrap this fabrication, okay. Why did we have to scrap that? Is the job gone? I thought we still had a thing to do. Okay, no, apparently we don't. How is that after glitching out? I don't remember even actually. Scrap by any dyes used have been returned to her inventory. Okay. All right, well, at least then it's not a total waste. Okay, so let's kind of work on this fabrication. We have to craft create five candles all right have we got anything else that we can recycle to i want to keep all them oh, i forgot about the socks that we made all right there's nothing really to you know scrap so um can we actually work on our plants and stuff we've got random bluebell plants everywhere um Okay, we've got some stuff that needs to be evolved. Um, okay, anything else? Okay, I think everything else is fine. No more twinkling, so that's fine. Are you needing a twinkling? No. Okay, everything is perfect. Okay, so let's just work on the fabricator. I'm hoping we can actually make another chair, like an outside chair. You're an outdoor chair. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. We can make a dresser. No way. Oh, ah, single bed. We could fabricate a single bed. No way. I want to do the dresser. I, I honestly want to make the dresser. And let's go for this one because we have that die. Okay, so she's going to do a dresser. And that is definitely how many bits and things do we have left? Okay, we're fine for bits and pieces. Okay, um, let's have a look at the other ones that were meant. Oh, okay, he got promoted. I think he got a planter box and starter herbs. Ooh, yay. So, and his painting's coming along fine as well. So, like, come on, they're guard. Like, it's really something pretty, right, at, at this point in time. Let him resume that and then. Oh, and we gave him a clean shave. He's clean shaven now. Um, how are we already in the first day of autumn? I, 
Okay. Um, her birthday is in a few days. And his birthday is literally the day before hers. Oh, that's so cute. We could kind of do a joint party though. We can have the two of them have the birthday on the same day. Okay. Does that mean then she's nearly out of young adulthood? Does that mean she's nearly out of young adulthood? Let me just check. Because, uh, yeah, we have 14 days till we age up. And he has 13 days till he ages up. Okay. Okay, alright, that's actually, a, I really like that idea. Um, they'll be both going into adulthood together, and it means we can upgrade the house. <laughs> so, that's going to be so much fun. Alright, and I think, like, when we move on to the next generation, I'm going to freeze aging for her, for Daisy and Lex, because I just won't be able to cope. Okay. Still fine. Okay, let's. Sorry, I was gonna say we were gonna have a look at their skills. Let's have a look. Okay, she is fabrication level six. She is handiness level eight and wellness level five. Okay, because she is preggers, I do kind of. We can't use that one. Okay, so can we pop this here then? Um, this is her little area. Can we meditate? Oh my god, we can meditate. Awesome. So, okay, we're going to have to sell things at a market soon. And do I still have the table? I don't have the table. Did I actually sell the table for bits and pieces? Did I actually, or did I use it for scrap in the recycling machine? Okay. Okay, he's happy. No plants need tending. Okay. So, he doesn't get an awful lot of buffs. About um, his outdoorsy lifestyle is. So, I'm going to have him just take a shower. And I, do, I don't know. I think they should have um, an old time romantic. Who are you? Hot pause. Celine Lopez. Celine Lopez, I'm sorry. But we're about to have a date evening. Um, but thank you. Okay. Oh, we got our girl meditating. Okay, so what level are we now on fabrication? Because we just created a... Okay, we're still on level 6. And we did actually make the dresser doll. Like, okay, so it might be in household inventory. Um, I can check by just using the recycling machine. It'll show us what we have. Oh my god, she did that. So we have a fabricated floor lamp and a fabricated dresser. And we can now do single beds as well. Okay, he's in the shower. I'm just going to leave him alone. <laughs> um, what the? What? What is happening? She... Is this what happens when you master wellness? Uh-uh. Mm -mm. Lex, you need to come out here and repeat this cow kind of plant. Um, our girl can levitate. I love wellness. Making materials from the maker's tray. She's in the final trimester and she's had smooth sipping. Oh god. Okay. Um, our girl is actually tired though. And that's after freaking me out a little bit. So we're just going to have her go to bed. Oh no, wait, wait, no. It's date night. It's date night. No, no, girl. It's not. No, 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 no. Let's get you to have a shower. And I'm just going to have uh, Lex um, hopefully barbecue up some food if we have it there. Uh, mushroom steak. Yeah, all we can make is mushroom steak. Okay. I'm not too happy about mushroom steak. Um, but yeah, we can make mushroom steak on the grill outside. And can we make a garden salad? Have we got enough stuff in it? Or is it a fruit salad? I can't remember if it was the fruit salad or the garden salad we could make. 
the fruit salad we can make for nothing and we don't have enough ingredients for anything else okay but we do have fruit salad in the fridge so okay so what's happening <gasps> oh 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 no 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 extinguish him please go out. <laughs> oh my god no oh my god fires can be vital source of heat oh my god did he not know how to use the grill singed fire looming dread of fire you so much seriously yikes that was so close i owe you big time oh my god don't go into labor don't go into labor it's fine it's fine what's happening oh my god my entire house is going to set on fire oh Carlos. Quick question. Murder Roswell and I were planning to spend some casual friend time. Um, you know, don't be asking your son for questions like that. My God. Oh my God. Um, seriously, sweetie, can you just please go and take a shower? You could have put our girl into early labour. Oh, so much for day at night. She's fallen asleep from pure exhaustion on the camper chair. Oh, that was, that was scary. That was scary. Um. I don't know, for some reason. <laughs> I don't want this anymore. <laughs> okay, stop fast forwarding, shall. Um. We have a new sentiments, of course, with our wife. Let's have a look. Loves outdoors, freaking and a maker. She went to high, she's a high school graduate. Soulmates, spouse, neutral chemistry, perceived as basic looking. Awed by life-saving hero. Deeply connected, outdoorsy trait. Okay. So that's his new sentiments because she saved his life. But that also means he got the fear of fire. Does that mean he won't cook anymore? I'm going to have to replace this. It's our only form of hot food. Um. Oh my god. He won't grill anymore. Oh. Girl, you need to go up and go to the bathroom. And then you can go back to sleep afterwards. I promise. Um. Oh, she's craving healthy food. I'm just going to have her go to the bathroom first and then I'm going to click on the new thing. Perks, Nissy. Okay, I'm going to go get for her craved food. Bathroom first, my love. Thank you. Okay. Um. So Lex nearly died. Lex nearly died. And I don't know how I feel about that. Lex nearly died. And he's now trying to calm down by doing a shape in his bonsai tree. Oh my god, this is like, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh my god, and it's happening, it's happening, it's happening. Oh my god, it's freaking happening. Oh my god, we're about to have a baby. Oh frick yuck. Oh god, are we having it at the hospital? Or are we having it at home? I'm sorry if I'm so close to the microphone again. Okay, pregnancy. Reproductive. Alright, so is there another option now for. Nope. Nope. Okay, we're gonna have to go. To... I'm gonna send her to hospital alone. Because I'm scared. <laughs> Okay, go to the hospital and we're going to send you alone. 
Um, that way we are just going to have to wait and see what the baby is going to be. And oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> okay. So, name suggestions. Um, Alright, first name suggestion I'm after receiving is actually from... Oh, it's a girl! Daisy just gave birth to a baby girl. This baby needs a name. What would you like to call it? Now, if you remember from the rules... We have to give it a, um, a nature themed name and I was racking my head because I've recorded a few of these in advance and I'm just there like I don't know. Okay so these are the names I was given. Because we've already used the name Daisy we've got Iris, Hazel, Willow, River, Rose, Juniper, Lily, Olive, Poppy, Delilah um, or is it Dahlia? Um, Kala, Violet, Jasmine, Amber, Jade, Clementine, um, Autumn, Aspen, Blossom, Aurora, Flora, and Luna. Wow. So, because we have gone with Daisy, which is my favourite flower at the moment, I am so obsessed. And um, this name actually popped out like but myself and my daughter said the name at the same time because it also resembles someone else so we are going to go with the name Lily and it's Lily Whimsy I'm going to have to change that I'm actually going to have to change Lex's last name as well actually no, we'll leave La uh, Lex's name as it is and uh, we are going to do Lily Whimsy and we are doing this for my sister Lily and uh, that's it. So we've got a daisy and a lily. And lilies are also my other favourite flower. Where's the baby? Where's the baby? Oh my god, look what they put the crib. We got a lily. Oh my god, we got a freaking lily. Whew. Okay, let's fix up crib and let's um ooh, I forgot we had all this stuff. And okay, let's turn crib around so mum and dad can if I pop it there, can mum and dad still get by? They can indeed. Okay, and I'm thinking about moving this in here. Okay, all right, that's perfect for in there. And then this should fit here. This is the fabricated um, thingamajigger. <laughs> and then we're going to use this fabricated light for some light in the bedroom. Okay, so I'm up here. There we go. Okay, so we have officially had our first baby. This is your last name, Bert Sylvia Whimsy. No, we're going to have to change that in Cass. So Daisy and Lex have had their first Babaroo. And her name is... Aww. Her name is Lily Whimsy. And she is, of course, going to be our Gen 2. But until we complete all of Gen 1's um, uh, goals and the aspiration, I'm just going to say right now, we've officially welcomed the very first baby in the Whimsy Challenge. So guys, I'm going to end the episode here. Enough has happened in this episode. I hope you guys are having an absolutely amazing uh, day and that you are enjoying the Whimsy Challenge so far. Uh, anyone who's new here, make sure you are subscribed to the channel so you're told every time we upload a new video here and I also want to officially welcome you to the Pear Bear Gang and I shall see you guys all in another episode. Bye!